Hello everyone, welcome to another Lurch Mode video and today, what, what, you thought I had forgotten? I did not forget and I will not miss it. So, Limited the Challenge stages came out, uh, I usually did this uh, video on the daily when they came out, but I was busy the first two days, so I decided to save them out for the last day and then show them to you all. And of course, this is the free-to-play lineups that are on full auto that work. Of course, unfortunately, IGG made it impossible for one of the missions since we don't get to choose what heroes to use. So unfortunately, I do not have the lineup to show you for that one. I will give you tips on how to do that one if you have not completed it so far. So starting off, I'm going to be showing you the lineups because I already did them. So with the very first lineup, we're looking to add Prima Donna for the healing. And uh, right here, this guy. I keep forgetting his name because we don't know we don't use him too much. Uh Crow, I think is his name. So this lineup will on full auto will pass you the the level. And I'll be putting a screenshot of me being the level so you don't have to go through the whole four or six minute process for every single stage. Since you know well, I don't want to make the zero way too long. Now going to stage two. Stage two, I was able to complete it adding who was it? It was according to here. I have Rose Knight, Prima Donna, and Snow Queen. Now the reason this works is because we have double the healing here on for full auto as well as the shield and uh crowd control that is provided by Snow Queen. So running this lineup on stage two will give you the the win on full auto. By the way, no for full auto uh pass throughs. If it does not work the first time, make sure to exit out completely, uh, like get get out completely to this to this place, and then go back in there and set it up again with the same heroes and run it again on full auto, and it it will eventually work. It really depends on certain crits and certain luck on RNG, but you you don't have the time to actually do step by step. Full autos is the way to go. Now stage 3 I believe is the one that you don't get to choose, oh no we do get to choose, no stage 4 then. Now for stage 3 I think, um, let's see, the lineup was Rose Knight, T Squire, and Prima Donna. This lineup is, is of course like all the other lineups that I'm giving you. It's a free to play lineup that you can use on any account, this includes your, uh, your hi uh, hyper accounts, your alternate accounts, so you don't have to spend too much time on them. So this is the lineup of full healing, the healing factor that provide plus this crowd control of petite uh have, have a really big impact and are and allow you to pass the level uh completely uh on on full auto now for stage five it was tricky to find that i had to run through multiple of them but it took me a while i found one lineup that worked which was prima donna and um incinerator Prima Donna Incinerator for stage 5 on full auto, uh, the crowd control provided by Incinerator. Uh, there is chances where uh, where Centaur gets one, gets critted out on stage 2. If that happens for you, uh, cancel it, get leave, and then come back. And as long as he survives stage 2, I believe you, you win stage 3 easily, part 3 of it. And now for the last one on stage five, on stage six, uh, we have for stage six we are running a weird lineup. I I don't know how this worked, but it, it worked out. I never like using uh, assassins for these lineups due to the fact that they jump away from the team. But in this case, it did work. So we also have prima donna added to there and crow. So these four heroes free to play, of course, running them. Uh, on full auto, make sure you activate full auto. You will be able to beat the level easily. So this is pretty much the free to play full auto uh, lineups. Again, um, I you uh, I don't know if I can like timestamps because it's gonna be all different. But these are the lineups for you to check out, for you to use. You need to the complete. You still haven't completed the stages. I hope you find it helpful. I hope you, you're able to get them on your alternate accounts. And i catch you in the next one. Actually, no. I forgot. Stage 4. Stage 4 is a, a little tip I have for you guys on Stage 4. 
is to use Shrux ability on the Aquarius that come out, which are the which is the one that heals them, that heals the enemy. And you and you're lucky enough if you're using the charm on them, it will heal your your units, your heroes. And then once all the Aquarius are there, you can use them on the main tank, which is usually comes out to be a uh, Watcher. And Watcher will be uh, reducing damage that your allies, that your heroes take. So that, that, that's my tip for stage four, since you don't get to choose the lineup and full auto does not work on this one. I, ho I hope you find this information helpful and I catch you in the next one. Peace.